here in downtown Coblins. We're on the way to the cable car. We're really happy because it's just stopped raining, just in time. Got this magnificent old church behind us. The Old Stead Hotel. This is right in the middle of downtown Coblins. Beautiful spot. Yeah, so just go straight up this road. It's like a all right, we got Google Maps guy on the it's job. Like at the oh, end of, it's like at the end of this road. The water is really green. Yeah, right. This is the Coblins History Column. 2,000 years of history. First century at the bottom. Wow. Right, here's the history lesson. At the bottom we've got 1st to 5th century, the Roman settlement. Then we've got 6th to 9th century is the crown dominion and the meeting place. Then we've got the 12th and 13th century. Here it's the von Frankenstein Reich. Going up we've got 12th and 13th century which is the crusades and the slave trade. 17th and 18th century is the Thirty Years' War and the persecution of the witches. 18th century is French Revolution. Then we've got the Second World War where everything blew up. Right at the top we've got... Today. A forward-looking town. And the sign here says, Silbein Koblen. Let's check it out, yo! Well that was a win, we got our two tickets. Cost, uh, how much Clark? 17, 17 euros. 17.90 euros. Yeah, we decided to get um, a combined cable car and fortress ticket. Because you get a combined ticket and it costs just a little bit more, so why not? Oh, there we go, that's us catching the cable car up the top of the hill to check out the fortress. Ah, I guess you buy tickets here, but we already bought them. Let's rock and roll. Hey, look, that one fell off. What the? Hope they're all right. What? Actually looks quite ancient this castle. Look at all the old stone walls at the bottom. Oh, it's a fortress. And it's massive. Yeah, we just realised it's super windy up here because we're quite high now. Wrapping the cage. Yeah. Okay, just got off the cable car, found the map, and yes, this place is massive. Not sure how much we'll get to see. So, can you figure out where we where we are? We just can't believe it. The sun's just come out. 
supposed to be pouring rain all day, but no, it's sunny. Term Ungamont. So, we've seen that we've just entered a museum and we have no idea what that is. But this is super cool. It's an ancient piece of weaponry. Looks like a crossbow firing those big oh, arrows with the flaming flax torches. Watch me run my hand down this sword. And of course some armour. Everywhere in Germany's got armour. Well, this museum's a bit weird. We've got no idea where we're supposed to go. But we keep hitting all these dead ends everywhere. Well, this looks promising. There's that crazy museum we got stuck in. Now we're in a courtyard and we're exploring mode. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's, doing well. it's welcoming music. They're welcoming us. So we seem to have tagged onto some guys of tour here. Eh? I wonder if they're talking in English. How'd you find me? Here we are. That's our Oh, it's English. That's right, though. That's the most important type of defense. They are saying you wouldn't have expected such a large open space. Yes, that's rather in our walls. Imagine the enemy finding himself in this death. Go in and have a look. Ravelin. Which maze do we got? This one? Alright. What is that thing? Yeah. Let's go up here. This looks really cool. Well, do you know? It's another big military wide open space. Yeah, let's face it, we're lost. Probably like the Royal Coat of Arms or something like that. Oh yeah, there's the view we want. place to ourselves, there's all these tables and chairs for the restaurants, but we're it, no one else is here. Clark's found a good guard's box he likes it because it's not windy. <laughs> I think Clark will like these. 
Got no idea what TPs are doing in a German military fortress. That's a lot of fun. Yeah, we're on the way out now. I think we might try this way. Chairlift. Very careful. So this is pretty much the last stop. We just spent a week here in Germany. Yeah, we spent three nights in Heidelberg, four nights in Koblenz, had a look up and down the Rhine River and the Moselle River, had a look at all the castles and awesome stuff. How did you like Germany, Clark? It was awesome. What's the best thing about Germany? Yeah, I say castles. And today we finished off our tour with a walk around Koblenz. Had a look at the fortress just behind us and got some really good views of Koblenz, the Rhine River and the Zell. Anyway, that's about all from us in Germany. Tomorrow we're off to Luxembourg. Bye bye Germany! Now walking along the Moselle River. First time, actually, we've done a few walks along the Rhine. This is our first walk along the Moselle River.